God willing, the shark of us today. I will go to the Sifrit's Neot after that. We're on page uh, Shin Yud Aleph. And we're on the place where he's going through the writings of the, as we're writing each individual letter. Some kind of shot over here. It says, Your class of Ozvov, Ron Ozvov, you cover the Hagat Nai. Right? That's that's the six spheros. The Hamalchus Kololosam, Kololosam, and then Malchus gathers them all together. Bashita said, Bimishna, Shalom Kanoid. Now, I have no idea what that means. But she's six also. Well, there's six coming into her. Not sure what that means. But the Kavan El Rosh Ozvov. So look at the, the, the Kavana should start. I don't know. Or extra also. Uh, look at the Ozvov, the top of the Rosh Vov, El Ladas El Yon, which refer to the upper Das, Hanimshach Mekachov, which is coming through it, through Kachov, comes into the top of that letter Vov. Okay, so let's go to the next one. The next one says, So uh, you should have Kavana for the ten spheros that are part of what the Heyach Rona would be because I guess it's wrapped up in some models. Kihi Oz Hey, Bitsiura, who do, do like this, Dalin Vov. Shehem Eser, which is ten. That's the ten you should be thinking about. Okay, then it says Tosefis, Kavona Luxivis Hashem. So he said, Gam, Takavin Biyud. Also, you should look at the Yud, El Shem Av, that should refer to the, the letter, to the name Av, Vavahe El Shem Sag, Vavahe El Shem Ma, Vavahe El Shem Ma, Shem Ben. So those are also some of the Kavanos. Then he says, Tsuras uh, Osias Kulam, so looking at all of the letters, Gambat Tsuras Osias Shal Kasivas Tzfilim, now looking at the way that she looked, Yesh Katsav Shinoyim Vayelohim, there's some differences. And these are the differences that he says. He says, let's try the Aleph. He says, Ba'os Aleph, Yikavim Kikhalo Alofim Gihil Betzir Yud Vav Dalad instead of Yud Vav Yud. So he said, "Bitzir Yud Bav Dala Melamala Kaniska B'Tikunim from up above." And why he said from up above, he said B'Tikunim itself Tikun Yud Tes. So that's where it is up above the Mata Tihi Yud B'Tzuchus Dalit. So he means there's a Yud up above the line and a Dala down below Kaniska B'Tikunim Sham B'Tzuras Aleph, which is a Yud Bav and a Dala. Uh, he Yud Bav Dala, but Tam a So why? The fee, uh, he said, who the fee shall not fill him shall rosh. Haim ima al barak and niska bitikunim. So that's what that represents. It's the ima. She's feeding into the sun. Uh, bitikunim of the chain called suras al lofim shabbat tefillin. So they're all, therefore, all of the form of the olives that you find in tefillin. Haim kitsuras and niskar, which is this olive. Masha Ain came to Shar Kala Osius, which is not the case of any other letters. Kabo Shinim, say, for example, Ainin, of Hatsadi, Bakhim Yotzebenem, Ki Kulum, Hey, Bakhim is Yudin, Lod Suras Zainin, and not forms like Zainin. Now, that could just kind of put that in there without a lot of explanation of the Zainin, but I guess you could make it like a Zion. Suras Hey Rishon Shal Rabayan. Those hey Rishon the Shal Shem Avaya. How about that one? First hey, Kulim Yehi Alechem Kei Kaayin Kutz Echad Katan Maod Lamad. So down below it has a little Kutz. He said a a Besiyum a Regal Vav at the end of the Regal Vav, which I guess would be the right line. Zeirish. Uh, so he says, excuse me, that would be the the left line at the end of the small Vav, uh, which is. Uh, uh, so we see that the left the left leg, there's a little kutz there. That's what we call the old good old the basil labar. This is what it looks like. He says uh, it actually looks like a hay dalad with a little yud down there. That's what it looks like to me. 
He says, uh, Tzuras Ozvav. Let's go to the Tzuras of the Ozvav. Ozvav Kul Yiyelachem Guf. Barosh Vekutz. So they all have of these three qualities. There's a line, there's a head on it, and then there's a little tip. So he says, Vekutz Katna Ala Rosh Vezechem Tzuras Vav. That's what the Vav would look like then. And so it has a little upward turn at the end. Oz Yud. Then he says, the Tzuras Oz Yud. The Yud Kul Yiyelachem Gimel Kutzim. So he says, Echa the Malo, the Echa the Mata, the Echa Bemsa So this is it right here. It has a little kutz in the top, and then it has another line, and then another line. That's that. Then he says, Os, uh, Tsuras Os Tes, Os Tes Kulim Yihio Kab Smoli. So how does that work out? Kab Smoli Shabachem, Kaayan Zion. So it's really written like a Zion. Is that Suris? It's a Rasa, so I guess that's supposed to be. I see, can see a Zion on the left, and then the left, I'm not sure exactly. Suris Os Ayin, he says, uh, he says, but Os Ayin, Kulim Yihia Hakavin, Shabahem Ka Ayin Vavim. So all the lines there would be like Vavim, below Ka Ayin Zaini. Okay, not like the test. So you figure all of those are going to be little lines. Uh, so here we're coming around to the end here, and it says, uh, So the tzadik that they'll all be heads. They'll be yihu shnei roshim. It's gonna. It has two set heads. Ka'ayin shnei yudin, and the heads look like two yuds. yud So the one on the right is gonna be like an upside down or backwards uh, yud. Lacharachel. Uh, so it turns backwards. The smolik ayin nun kafu for the mata, and then the left side is going to be like it's a yud, but it's turned down. The yud, yud, yushara al rosh, al rosh nun kafu for him. So you have the yud, little yud on uh, bent over yud uh, on the uh, on the head of the nun. Uh, you have a nun there. The zechav and This is what it looks like. Suras os shin, so os shin, kulim yihia ha gimel kavim shebechem. So those three lines that you find in the shin, kain gimel vavim, v'loch kain gimel zaini. V'zeret sirasa. This is what it should look like. So here's the last part. It says nashara lahak lahakpid al suras osia. So you have to be careful about what they look like. He yesh bechem so this gedolim because there are great secret within the letters. So he said, for as P. Mari Zal. So I asked my, uh, at the mouth of my master, he said, the Indian Suras Osius in regards to the Suras of Osius, as Shah Batamish and William for the Luke and Yeh Ben Kasivas as Fardim, the Kasivas Ashkenazim. He said, of Omele, he the Kuldam Yeh Ramish besowed Nirmaz Lamala. So all of them. Have a reference. They are tied to something in spiritual space. Because there are lots of different ways that the letters can be written. The letter Aleph. So he said. Sheba Alef Ka'ayin Zion. So the first one they write it like a Zion. Sheyesh Bezech of a Remez Besefa Tikunim. Begam Ta'ayin Bamasha Kasa Bezahir Mepasha Vayikra. Beinian Kasi Besechavaya Anaz Sham Hated. So over there they have something good to say. Ve'ech Tzarech Asofa Bezacher Bekasi Beshalah. So we're going to stop there. And tomorrow, Mitzvah Shem will start the third rush. I don't think there's any other pieces unexplained like this with all of these different things. I guess that would, that would have gone uh, very, uh, very deep. Okay, so let me stop this and we'll go.